Okay, on the count of three, one my really good friend. Everybody say your name. Cool. Oh. <laughs> we all say our own really names at the same time. Yeah. Aiden, we got it. Sean. Boom. <laughs> Like, two, here, you have two hands. Hold this for one second while I go throw away my gum. Uh, okay, it's it's my turn to run the show, and I say we're gonna do a that '70s show shot of everybody right now. So. You have a dope house. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Do we live here? I've lived here since yeah, I was a little kid. It must have been fun Wait, to grow up there. Is this, is this a whole like Narnia? Mm-hmm. Who wants yeah. to fall and check out the shed? I don't want It's kind of gross. I haven't been in there in a really long time. Are we allowed? No, we don't. I didn't even ask for this. Are we allowed? It's okay, go for it. <laughs> this whole part back here, um, behind the fort was once burned down by a fire, like a wildfire, and it came through and like almost burned down this neighborhood, but Jeez. it didn't. We evacuated and we came back and half our backyard was burned. That's sketchy. Wow. Yeah, That's good. Your house is shed was yeah, the shed. yeah. So it's everybody's favorite natural disaster, not that any of them are good, <laughs> but like if you had to pick one that is aesthetically cool to, to you. To be in? To have no, happen? No, no, not to have happen, just like 
the idea of one without the the trauma and the horrible things. That's which a is messed impossible. up question. Wow. Sorry. Scratch what I say. Oh, that's a good question. I a sandstorm. What? Okay. Okay. I survived the sandstorm. Straight up apocalypse. You don't know it's natural, you just saw it hit you. You don't know where it came from. Uh, cool you, so exactly. exactly. you don't either. You'd be like, whoa. Yeah. Well, there's this, you know, this is crazy thing where if uh, you put the first Ufio record to when the tornado shows up, <laughs> it ends 40 minutes into the film. <laughs> Can we trade clothes again? <laughs> you like, gave it away! Like you just, <laughs> well, we'll just edit that part. <laughs> there are two Yuffie's besides... We just, we just got rid of one of them. <laughs> you got rid of them. <laughs> no, there was an old man whose name was Yuffie. He got the one that was just Yuffie on Instagram. And he seemed like a nice guy, and he hit him up, you and like, he was like, like running you want to switch with us? <laughs> yeah, he's like a we runner. Him, we're like, stop calling yourself Yuffie. No, you we didn't. We were, we were, we were nice. nice. We asked. Was very nice. Said please. He, yeah, said okay. he was really yeah, nice about it. Yeah. He's like, good luck with the music, and yeah, you guys can have Yuffie. I'm Yuffie 16 now. Oh, <laughs> oh well, he also kind of upped you, though. Yeah, he's he's time time now 16. <laughs> <laughs> Has there already been a band called Shake the Baby So the Love Comes Out? No. <laughs> yeah, like in, the so we, in 1935 yeah. on the Chitlin yeah. circuit, there was a. I think if there is, we rip them up pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. it's like
come up with the band name? Just a lot of thinking. Yeah. <laughs> think about the visual, because I'm often like, when I think about your band name, I'm just like... No, we just think that. try to avoid that. Let's go. Come on. Come on. I love yeah. you. That's why our baby is not a mascot of, yeah. this, of this band. It's more of an idiom. It's more like... That's, that's funny. There's, there's like a baby mascot in our band now. Yeah, that's oh, kind of nice. interesting. Yeah. And on both um, covers of things we released, there's well, there's a baby, and then there's a kid, toddler type. That's kind of our baby. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know a how old he is. It's right. a toddler it's like, thing. There's so a kid. Youngin. 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 disease involved. Somewhere between two and four. <laughs> yep, exactly. <laughs> you get it. So. What does you feel mean? Is that a word? It's from a short story called the You Feel Question. I don't think it was a word before that. Okay. And it's cool. a machine in the story that takes sounds from black holes. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, it like reverse engineers the black hole. No, it just, apparently the whole joke of the story is that it doesn't really do anything. It just makes you like stupid and feel really good. <laughs> so people who listen to the radio when they play this recording are like, yeah. like, doing well, like stop life. feeding nice. children, so stop lives. eating, that's stop going to the bathroom. And that's your goal with music? <laughs> you just sit there and, and forget to do everything. <laughs> forget.